Drive a truck ran escape police twice before the surprise of his life. 2023, an officer observed a pickup truck passing him at a high rate of speed in Eau Claire, Wisconsin. He estimated the speed of the truck to be 45 miles per hour and realized he wouldn't be able to turn around and pursue it. Instead, he broadcasted over the radio about the truck, which was later learned to be driven by a 28-year-old male named John. Moments later, another officer coincidentally spotted the truck and noticed John had difficulty maintaining his lane. Additionally, dispatch advised the vehicle had expired registration. A traffic stop was then initiated. However, John immediately started accelerating away and did not seem to be making an attempt to stop. Go, John, go! Go! Get out of there! You got that truck, use it! We're at 6th and Broadway going towards Walker. Get out of there, John! Due to it being a Friday night in a densely populated college area, and with office... Sorry, I'm late pick early pack of my house. You ready for a move tomorrow? Good luck on your move. Thank you so much for so bits. already aware of the vehicle's Good luck return. Your move. It was moving decided sucks. to I hate moving. the pursuit. Small sample units, copies. Nora 28, terminate pursuit. William 150, copy. 10 4 10 8. Are they giving up? Northbound on <sighs> About five minutes later, oh, they gave John's up. truck was located in a hospital parking lot. An officer then positioned his squad car at a distance until additional units arrived to block it in. The truck eventually began driving away, and police made a brief attempt to pursue again, but quickly terminated it once more. Brake lights are on. That's going to be leaving here, going towards you. <sighs> He's going. Go, John, go! You got this! No need to pursue, guys. Subsequently, officers were instructed to position themselves near John's home. They later confirmed that he continued to pass by his house, likely due Cops to Cops are presence. so lazy for real. Well, it's like that whole thing of they don't want to chase someone in, like, a residential area because, of you know, they don't want to, uh, whatever... Danger, 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 danger. My leg, my leg, it's, it's, ah, mom, mom, wake up, mom, wake up. Mom. After a few more minutes elapsed, another officer found you know John I mean? at a gas station near a pump. Upon confirming that it was indeed the fleeing truck, he positioned his squad car in front of it. Hey, bud. What's going on, man? Going up, going home. All right. Why are you were running from us? Uh, I'm more blocking this truck. Come on. Come on. Just keep your hands on your truck for me. Yep. Just put your hands on your truck for me right now. Yeah. Are you a little intoxicated? No. Nope. Why, why were you running, man? I have no idea what you're talking about. Are you doing okay? You have a medical emergency or anything? I'm just going home. Where do you live at? Um, right down the road. Right down the road. What's your name, brother? John. John. This is your truck? It's John! Oh, I gotcha. He's yeah, got man. his car hard, he's got his Oakleys on, his trucker hat. And yeah, you're going kind of fast. Alright, this truck is only going to my house and that's it. Yeah, because I saw you come, you went up uh, Star just a second ago pretty fast. I'm just, I'm just getting gas. Okay, because we got to, we got to talk to you about that because... Guys, not gonna lie, like, he's really convincing me. Like, he's really convincing me right now. Some of our officers uh, tried to stop you and you took off. You don't remember? All this is going and getting gas and going home. <clears throat> no, our officers tried to stop you downtown by kind of like Madison Street I believe him, same. I believe him, too. I have not been. I have come from Chippewa. No, you didn't come from Chippewa. I came from downtown. My husband worked in a case where a cop was speeding through a neighborhood chasing someone and the person fleeing hit a person and the cop was sued because she uh, should have abandoned the chase. Yeah, exactly. Like cops, cops ha normally have to abandon the chase, especially when it's like in a residential area like that. Well, clear, man. Came from, came from Chippewa. To where were we in Chippewa? Over by, uh, over by, uh, City Farm. As several more officers arrived, you really had to think about that one. Truck in. John came to the realization that he was in deep shit. Ruh-roh. 
Okay. Rot row. I remember a time when the only meth I had was ball sacks. I was bubbling mad scrotes. Pig, you were my best friend at the time. Oh, hey, I'm... Tell them what you thought about our other buddy, Hank Hill. I remember him mad, clapping your cheeks quite a few times. I think the Tigers deserve to know your progress. Chat. He will never hub of Skype. What? Huh? What? I don't remember any of that. What do you mean? So you've been drinking tonight then? Looks like you have been. Right. How much have you had to drink tonight? Be honest. Just trying to go home. It's all. Stop being contacted. Oh my god, dude. It's all I'm trying to say. Holy shit. I'm trying to go home. Holy shit! Bro, how many cops do you need? Oh, there you go. What's going on, Matthew? Jesus. It's not, it's not Matthew. Oh, I'm sorry. John, right? John. What's going on, man? Just going home. No, you... Why are you fleeing Just from us, though? Grabbing gas, going home. I get that, but Yeah, why they are you really pulled up. It, dude, it's... And they literally just come out of the woodworks and say the same shit. Like, one pulls up. Hey, John. Why'd you run from us? Another pulls up. Hey, John. Why'd you run from us? It's just like the mine, the the mine birds, over and over. It's just keep pulling up. Hey John. Hey John. Hey John. Hey hey John. Hey John. Hey hey John. Hey John. He just starts freaking out and screaming. Oh, how many of them are there? Hey John. Hey John. Oh, I'm just going home. Okay, you're going home now, but you've been fleeing from us the whole time. I've had it on video. You don't I'm want just it? going home. Okay. Have you had much to drink tonight? I don't know. Not enough? Okay. They're Are cloning themselves. Shadow clone jutsu! I'm just trying to go home. And, and that's your story? Yep. Okay. You're under arrest. Okay. We are one, John. They all start chanting. Knife in the right pocket. Right, he, you got the knife out already? Yeah. While speaking with him, an open can of bush light was noticed in plain sight inside his truck. No, John! Oh, oh, smell the truck too. Not bush yeah. light! There's a gun inside the gun inside the vehicle. Inside the vehicle. Kind of uh, it's a 9 mil. We're at? Inside, right by the driver's side seat. By the seat? Yep. Am I if we secure that so nobody else oh, gets it? Oh, yep. All go right. ahead. Go ahead. Do what, do what you gotta do. It's fine on me. me. All right. Well, we got to go down to the PD for fields. Right. So. I just figured since I tried sure. to stop him, I can take the fire. Guys, can you put, go ahead and secure in 160s and then open beer cold, full. Damn, it must have been a slow day. Holy shit. <laughs> they have like every cop in the entire county there. <laughs> First, Got a bit. It must have been a real Five slow day. Not yet. So it's next to the passenger seat. He said it was right next to the seat. So did you check right. under the seat or or wedged in between? Let's see it here. He might be so drunk he doesn't know. Well, it could be under. It could be in the center console. He was flying when he went past us. I just went normal. I figured he was gonna go to get get gas. Where was your hiding spot? Right there? at the, the car wash, right there. Were you on Star? Yeah. He saw you and went ripping. We can find a gun, so... Can you find a gun? I'd make sure I get on him. He wants to search him again? Yeah, I'd try again. Okay. John, where's the fire right around? It is inside the vehicle. Where inside the vehicle? <laughs> I'm, I'm not... <laughs> hey, John, where is it at? Oh, it's in the vehicle. <laughs> what the fuck? Pig, there's an acorn in the sh Wait, what do you mean there's an acorn in the truck? Where? Assault you if you Shoot him! And we're just, we're just asking for our own safety. So no, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. Should be. I took it off of my waistband, and it should be inside of the, the truck and the driver's side. Is it like tucked in between a seat? It should be tucked in the seat. Go ahead with that again. We're not seeing it up in the front. He's advising possibly tucked in the seat. On there, there's the no, there's no, 
There's no hostile thing here. I'm like sorry. I am. And you're being decent. Can, can you yeah. step back out with us, please? We're just gonna search you again. Make sure it's not on your person, okay? It, it, it is not on me. Okay. During a search of his vehicle, officers also discovered a bag of marijuana. No! Please. John! I'm not, I'm not. I didn't know you did illegal drugs. You disgusting person. Oh God. I just ruined my entire opinion about the guy. I like John, man. I liked him. I liked him up until then. Send him to jail. Life in prison. Life in prison, man. At least. Like I'm not Death. being beyond decent with us right Death now. To all of them. That. We you just got some, we got some we got some stuff to work out. Yeah. Okay, so we just need you to take a seat for now, okay. and we'll we'll walk through it all. Yeah. Okay. Could have tossed it. But Could have tossed it. Oh, why you tell us about it, though? Yeah. I mean, he's really pretty gassed. He is. It's not in here. Okay. He may have tossed it, or it could have been just at home, and he. It's not on him. No. So. We... He's pretty. He's pretty gassed, so he might just think it was in the truck. Dude, yeah. that's the biggest bus of his life that right there with that weed. Yeah, but he's saying it was in here and the whole uh, cabin here is, apart from all the booze and marijuana, there's no problem. A little weed. A little weed? A little bit. Looks pretty empty to me. Yeah. Figured he was going a quick trip. Why was he just walking around? A little bit of weed. Weed? Got a little bit of weed? A little bit of weed here? Are you guys saving that or something? Like, why are you showing everyone? All roads lead to KT. All roads lead to KT, yeah. Is that an open container, too? Lots yeah. of open containers. Yeah, marijuana, open containers. Did you have your lights and sirens on? I it's did. all like, yep. so felony fleeing. And weed? Then, Is that weed? And we'll do the 5-5 five five stuff <laughs> down at the, down at PD. My Just camera malfunctioned and doesn't have my 1080 on camera, that's, but... That's fine. That happens. We'll probably be on camera somewhere. City. We're just going in circles, basically. But he almost hit a vehicle. I thought he was going to hit me at the mail lot when he was coming yeah. at me. I was like, oh, yeah. he's going to rub my, my squad. It was pretty close. Well, Robert said he blacked out when he... So him and Roberts were coming like this, and he blacked out. Come why are you making the sound effects for the weed? Coming at Roberts. Yeah, that's that's why there's no reason to actually oh. pursue him. We knew oh, God, no. we knew where he was. We were we were yeah. gonna find him. So yeah. Sure. Are you guys good if I go with him? Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll meet, meet you, you down, down there. there. Okay, thank sure. you. Well, thanks everybody. Thanks for coming up. We appreciate your help. Three, two, one, team. He was then taken. All of that for like one dude. I don't know why I just find that so hilarious. You know what I mean? I don't the know. Police department to undergo standardized <laughs> field sobriety tests. Good work. You all did so much. It really took seven of you just to get this all done. But on her side, okay? All right, I'll have you step out. Yep. So essentially what I want to do is basically go through some tests to make sure that you are safe to drive tonight, okay? Yep. Are you going to be cooperative with us? Yep. Okay, so I'm going to take your handcuffs off. Obviously, if there's any issues, you're going to go right back in, okay? But we want to make sure that we give you this opportunity to see if you're safe to drive tonight. Yep. Sound good? Okay. Have you ever been through this kind of testing before? Yo, is that, uh, uh, is, is that, is he, is he, you say it, Queso? Is that you say his name, Queso? But I mean, like, <laughs> I mean, like, I mean, like, wait, let me move my face. Yeah. I mean, oh, wait, here's a better one. Yeah. Yeah. If he shaved his head? Yeah, 100% if he shaved his head. You're safe to drive tonight. Okay. Sound good? Okay. Have you ever been through this kind of testing before? Yep. Do you mind taking your hat off for me? Okay, so about a third of the weight. I wanted to get dirty. Yes. Good? No. I'm gonna have you put your heels and toes together, hands on at your side. I'm gonna hold my the floor isn't like collapsing. This, so is that like okay? I've never se watched any of his streams. I only see clips. Is that all his stream is? Is people send him shit of what they think he looks like, and then he bans them? Is that like the whole bit? That's like his entire stream. <laughs> oh man, you know what? That kind of sounds like my stream in a way. All you guys do is shit talk me all day. Follow my finger with your eyes and your eyes only. Do you understand? I mean, you guys say I look like Vegeta all the time, so it's pretty close. Keep looking, keep looking. The next 
next test I'm gonna have you do is called the walk and turn. Are you familiar with this? Three. I only Nobody gets banned, I think, but it's like, well, yeah, I'm sure he doesn't actually ban them, but. I only took three, but I want you to take nine, okay? And I can ban you guys though. Nine, I can ban you whenever I feel like it. Back. I did three. Calm again, down, Vegeta. Nine, don't get okay? mad. So when you're doing this test, I'll have you get back in that stance for me. Yep. Thank you. Imagine that straight line out in front of you while you're doing the test. All right, let's see how he does. Hands down at your side. I want let's you see to how he does. Let's go, Jake. One, two, three. Or John. You can start Josh. whenever you would like. John. Dude, look at them cowboy boots. How are you going to balance in them high heels, boy? Think of yourself like you're at the rodeo. Come on. Do the square dance. Okay, thank you. What you're gonna do for this next one, you're dude. He's got a he's got a pretty sassy step though. Like that flick, this flick right here. Yeah, that flick right there. That's a pretty sassy okay, step. Okay, thank you. What you're gonna do for this next one, you're gonna have your heels and toes together, okay, with your hands down at your side. While you're doing this, I want you to count one one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, so on until I tell you to stop. One. Nope. Can I switch? Yeah, that's fine. One. Sure you have two, that toe pointed out. Four, five, sure you have your six, toe pointed out, please. Seven, eight, Are you done? What? No. Okay. Just What's nothing, wrong? Nothing hurts. One, two, three. Obviously, I have some concerns about what happened tonight, right? I would like to do one more test. This isn't determined my decision on an arrest or not. I've already made that decision. In Those my boots head. weren't meant for walking. They were meant for square dancing. Hell yeah. I'm not going to let you know yet, but this will either, you know, support or support not an arrest. Okay. So dance on them, John. Just dance on them. For me tonight. That's all you got to yeah? do. Okay. Thank you. So it shows zeros. Have you ever blown into one of these before? Yep. Okay. John consented to a preliminary breath test, which resulted in 0 0.194. Oh, that sucks. That sucks, John. Come on, man. Them bush lights. Them bush lights, baby. So you typically don't drink? Trailers lately, after. So you guys are going to look it up. I have one to you. Uh, you I on okay. this adult. I was just trying to get home. Okay, fair enough. All right. Sounds good. Well, tonight you are going to be John. for another OWI. Okay. Poor John drinking and driving. That was sarcasm, by the way. Sorry, I did. I need to clarify this every fucking time. That was sar like, I, okay. Okay. Um, I am gonna hand. I'm not trying to have sympathy for a drunk driver. I am not trying to have sympathy for a drunk driver. I am not trying to have sympathy for a drunk driver. I'm not trying to have sympathy for a drunk driver. You in the front. We have a lot of paperwork to go through, and you've been very cooperative with me. Yep. So as long as you can continue to be I'm decent with me, gonna, we'll be decent with you. Okay, bud. I'm not gonna hold anything. Okay, sounds good. Have a seat there for me. Just hang tight for me. Okay, bud. Yeah. I mean, you could you could try, oh, but I don't think you're going to. So plus, not having hands to catch yourself when I would tackle you, that would probably hurt. Yeah, well, I can tell you what, future reference, it's always much- Wait, did, did he make a joke that he was gonna run? It's easier if you do get stopped or someone tries to stop you to just pull over. Yeah. You know, instead of making all the extra effort that you put in for the same result and extra charges, like, you're better off just stopping and- I thought the title says the guy escapes twins. All right. All right, Com calm down. All right, I know you're getting excited thinking this is like the, the, the start of like a porn or something like that. <laughs> Twins, <laughs> sign me up. <laughs> Who's stuck in the microwave? Wait, washer. That's that's the bit, right? Not, not, not a microwave, a washer. Or is it a dryer? Which one is it? Help me, step bro. I'm stuck in the microwave. <laughs> Is that is that the new one? Did they come out with a new one? They're stuck with the microwave. You know, owning up to your what you did, and instead of making it essentially worse for yourself, you know what I mean. Duh. John. Oh, 
was charged with felony vehicle fleeing eluding an officer, misdemeanor counts of OWI, second offense, and possession of THC. Due to his driving behavior throughout the city, he was given multiple traffic citations totaling over $1,200. Ultimately, he was released a few days later on a $1,000 signature bond. Damn, that's actually not bad at all. What the hell? Wow. That's it? Now it's time to walk away. I hope you enjoyed your stay. Did you laugh or cry or maybe subscribed? I'll thank you either way. you I hope you return tell your friend or your mother to get me more views please